working on water cruise ship is tough working with long hours of work and very strict rules that we need to follow well is that true so that is the most common question that people mostly ask me and before that guys so let me introduce myself my name is Indra and I'm from Bali Indonesia so currently I'm working on board the Carnival Miracle so I have been working on board a cruise ship for about 10 years so in this video we will talk about how is our working hours here on board the cruise ship okay first of all what is the rules exactly so regarding the working hours so the standard guideline for the working hours on board the cruise ship is not only for cruise ship actually so generally for the cruise ship fishing uh, tanker ship and they must in compliance with the MRC 2006 or Maritime Labor Convention 2006 as amended and the regulation or the standard guideline as follows Maximum hours of work shall not exceed 14 hours in any 24 hours period and 72 hours in any 7 day period or in one week Minimum hours of rest shall not be less than 10 hours in any 24 hour period and 77 hours in any 7 day period Alright, so that is the rules exactly and how is in reality on board the cruise ship how we are doing every day here on board the cruise ship so it was very clear there that no crew member shall make more than 14 hours in 24 hours period of work and also the working hours cannot be exceeding 72 hours in one week period so ideally our working hours is 10 hours a day and we're gonna make 70 hours in one week period so now it depends on what position that you do on board the cruise ship what kind of job that you do on board the cruise ship some kind of position make 10 hours of work a day and some might have less than 10 hours of work in one day so like a musician or entertainment staff they might have less than 10 hours a day of work but mostly like a hotel uh, department staff like me i am working 10 hours every day the 10 hours of work can be divided into two sections so like half morning and half evening we call it split shift so like five hours in the morning and five hours in the evening for example like a, like a cabin steward or stateroom steward they're doing a half in the morning in the section and half in the evening service that they do so they are doing the split uh, ship so in this split ship for one uh, section like in the morning for example and they must not exceeding seven hours of work in the one section so for example they have two sections morning and evening in the morning they cannot go exceeding seven hours same like in the evening they cannot exceeding seven hours of work so they can do like six hours in the morning and four hours in the evening or five hours in the morning and five hours in the evening right and the rest hours also in one of the section is going to have two sections of rest so one section must have six hours minimum of rest so consecutive six hours minimum of rest and the other uh, section will be the rest of the rest hours that they have and then how we record our working hours or rest hours so we'll be in compliance according to the guidelines here we do have a computer system that we can log in with our id and of course with the password and then we do, we're gonna do the check in over there when we are start working and also we're gonna do check out when we are stop working so the working hours will be monitored in the system and everything must be according to the guidelines 
so every each team member is responsible to do the check-in and check-out properly according to the schedule that has been given to them and this record cannot be manipulated cannot be uh, cannot be fake each team member will be responsible for their own working hours and then in one week period do we have a time off or do we have a day off while we are working on board the cruise ship okay do we have time off working on board the cruise ship it's not really mandatory to have a time off working on board the cruise ship but uh, maybe yes or maybe no it depends on the cruise line or some cruise line they they give their crew time off on a weekly basis but maybe some cruise line also may not giving the time off again it's not mandatory to have a time off working on board the cruise ship as long as the working hour is still uh, in compliance with the guidelines however here i am working on board the cruise ship that we have a time off in every week so every week we have a time off one day less hours or uh, less hours of work and we can enjoy outside like now today that i'm having my time off and i'm in ensenada mexico right now and enjoying my day here in ensenada mexico having my time off going out ashore going ashore and go some places enjoy or you just go rest during your time off so again it's not mandatory but yes some cruise line giving time off for their crew members all right guys i just coming back from outside so that's all about our working hours here on board the cruise ship so we're gonna talk more about how is the cruise ship library like here and if you're interested and please click the subscribe button and activate your notification bell so for the next video you will be notified and thank you so much for watching this video stay healthy stay safe don't forget to wash your hand more often and protect all people around you okay thank you so much and i'll see you again in the next video ciao ciao and see you goodbye